What's up, fam bam? I got all the kids with me because they're out of school today. Well, yeah. We're pulling up right here at Riverside. We're gonna go to this little jump spot called Love to Play. Get these kids out because Vanessa worked last night and uh, she needs to get her sleep. Nothing's worse than a pregnant woman who's grouchy who hasn't slept in 12 hours. I'll just play. Grandma Gloria's here, look it. Anyway, we're about to uh, go inside right now and go have a great time. I got some work to do. I'm actually editing this vlog right here. Daddy daycare, let's go. <laughs> Delilers. Hi, Mom, what you doing? Oh, there you are. Yeah, you having fun, man? I wanted to eat. Got Mom out here. What up, Mom? Hi, hi. Holding it down, chasing it down in the scooter. Yeah, mm -hmm. I ordered a large pepperoni pizza. And then for the kids, uh, a cheeseburger so they can split. You guys having fun, Pops? Uh, I'm dead. I'm full like Aya. Yeah, you guys are the same size. Come on, we're gonna go say hi. Come on. One of our subscribers right here. What's your name? Valerie. Say what's up, Valerie. Say hi. hi. Say hi. It's Delilah. Elijah. Say hi. Oh, and this is Layla. <laughs> All right, fam, man, we got the boys here. It's the boys, little man, Elijah. What's up, little man? Oh, look at that. Teamwork makes a dream work. Go ahead, man. Go ahead, knock it down. Oh. I'm gonna put you on my vlog, too. Hey. What's right on. Me? What's your name? Natalie. Natalie, good to meet you. Nice to meet you Likewise. too. <laughs> you taking a break? There's no breaks here. There's no breaks. <laughs> What's going on RBG fam bam? Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to another vlog with the RBG fam. If you guys are new to our channel, my name is Vanessa aka the Heine. Uh, the hubby robber also known as ODM is on his way home from work and both of the kiddos are actually at school today. It is Tuesday so that is when they are both in school which is nice. Gives me a little bit of free time for myself. So I was actually wanting to do a get ready with me today but my darn camera chip was not working and I literally just got it to work right now. I tried again and I'm like pretty much done with my makeup. Um, I've never really done a makeup tutorial. I am not good at doing my makeup, but I feel like a lot of you have always asked, can you please let me know what you use? Can you please do a makeup tutorial? Uh, your makeup looks so good, we wanna know. Um, I really appreciate that, you guys. I have never ever been good at my makeup. I just feel I just didn't get that gene, I don't know. My sister is amazing, my sister-in-law is amazing. But uh, I guess you can say I'm learning. <laughs> I sometimes don't even know what I am doing. I have started to watch some makeup tutorials. I think I have learned a little bit and then also watching my sister and sister-in-law, I definitely have learned from them as well. Before we do get started with the rest of this vlog, if you guys have not already, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also hit the bell button so that way every time we post, you guys will be notified. So if you guys have not noticed, I am actually in Layla's room right now. She recently switched over to the loft. So Layla did get this vanity for Christmas this year. She has this face fridge that I got her for Christmas that she really wanted. She has just a lot of facial products in here, masks, creams, spray, face rollers and all. And it's actually cold, you guys. It's pretty cool. Layla does have a small collection of lip glosses and She's allowed to use a eyelash curler with just a little bit of mascara. It's like a light brown color. That's just 
her little setup right here. So super cute. She needs to clean her mirror. So yeah, having said that, um, quick little updates real quick. This weekend is Elijah's birthday. My baby's gonna be four years old and I mean, I'm glad that he's growing, but I just wish he could have stayed a baby. <laughs> Makes me sad. So we're actually gonna be going to Legoland this weekend. I believe we're gonna go Friday, which is Valentine's Day. But we're gonna be staying in the Legoland Hotel and then wake up early, go to Legoland for the whole day and then come home Saturday night. I have only been to Legoland once when Layla was a lot younger. This is gonna be Elijah's first time. I believe it is Robert's first time as well. Um, Layla, she was young, so I don't even know if she really remembers. But it's definitely gonna be our first time staying in the Castle Hotel, which I heard and have seen like just amazing things. My sister-in-law and my brother went a couple weeks ago for my niece's birthday and they just had so much fun and I know Elijah's just gonna have just as much fun. It definitely beats having a birthday party because I am so done with having people at my house right now. I just can't take it anymore. <laughs> it's just stressful. Trying to keep my house clean because you guys know I'm always cleaning and just making sure that my house is picked up. No party this year for Elijah. Legoland it is and I know we're gonna have so much fun. Side note, we did have Elijah's first t-ball meeting yesterday he met his team and i think it's gonna be so much fun you guys i did volunteer to be team mom so wish me luck i have no idea what i'm getting myself into but at the same time i think it's gonna be fun i'm thinking of ideas for the kids as far as making like personalized water bottles personalizing their shirts and their hats because you guys do know i craft although i have not been doing it lately um with everything going on with like the whole pregnancy thing it has completely come to an end and I know some of you guys have messaged me on making things I am so sorry I apologize it is just not in my agenda right now you guys but as far as making gifts and stuff for the family I do try to make time for that and I'm gonna make time for Elijah's baseball team as well because I'm so excited for him he's like one of the youngest on the team you guys I think everybody is already four and five Elijah is three, he's my little baby, he's the baby on the team. He's gonna be four on Saturday, which was why he was able to actually start T-ball this year. So we are so excited for him. I actually posted on my Instagram Sunday night that I was at work and I had like one more hour left of work. Um, it was probably Sunday early morning and a lot of you guys messaged me like, oh my God, I didn't know you had a job. I didn't know that you worked. I thought you were a stay at home mom. And yeah, I think a lot of you guys do think that for the most part, I am a stay at home mom. I am actually a respiratory therapist. If you guys did not know, I work in a hospital. I do work night shift, um, but I am actually now per diem you guys. And that's basically not an on call basis, but so basically I put myself available on the schedule at work. And if they do need me, if someone calls off, if someone doesn't want to work and they see that I have available on that day, they'll call me and be like, hey Vanessa, you want to work today? So that's just kind of like how it works. Also, those of you hating saying I need to get a life and I don't do anything and I worry about my husband too much, I do have a job and I can actually save your life, okay? So that's on period. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish um, my mascara. We will catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right, fam bam, so we are heading to, what's it called, babe? Big five. <laughs> Big five. Because <laughs> we have to get Elijah some gear for T-ball. Tonight is his first practice. I'm so excited. I know Robert's excited. And of course, are you excited? Yeah! So I think we have to get him fitted for a glove. Hey, the biggest dilemma though is getting him a glove because we don't know if he's left or right. Yeah. But like I was showing her, he throws with his left hand. I don't know, parents, mm -hmm. you, how did you know? Did you just like guess and yeah. hope that he was right-handed or left-handed or do you go by what you know he's been throwing since he was two yeah so then i told him throw with your right hand and he kind of threw it a little awkwardly and i was like well what hand do you like to throw with and he pulled up his left hand left. it's just weird because i'm right-handed you're right-handed right babe i'm right -handed. yeah i think that being a lefty though is a is a gift and a curse i think uh it's a gift because on the field if he ever pitches like i was a pitcher i remember batting against left-handed pitchers. That was the worst. Oh. Like I dreaded that, because there aren't many of them. Do we I'm know what he bats? So. Do we know if he's a left? We don't know what he bats though, that's the oh. thing. Okay. So, so he may be a left-handed thrower and then a right-handed yeah. batter. Also you guys, I'm actually the team mom. I'm a team Eliza. <laughs> what kind of bat did you want? You told me earlier, remember? 
the green one. A green one? Like who? Like Damien. Whoa! Like Damien? He said he wants a green bat like Damien. <laughs> I wanted a coach. I'm actually going to help out. You know, during yeah. the week, I'm fine with it. Like, I can definitely make the practices. It's just on the weekends because I, I have shows coming up. Yeah. And, it, you know, which is considered work. And that's how we eat. I won't be able to make all the games. Bless you, Bubba. That's why I didn't want to fully commit myself to becoming a coach. But trust me, I would love to be a coach. Huge winter clearance. Ooh. See what we can find. Look how many need these. Oh, <laughs> they're so cute. Yeah, you can get them a nice little gray one since it goes the colors. It's too big, the extra small. No, we gotta do glove first, you know, okay? Glove first? It's always just brown, man. It's oh, I know. Good. Same here. I always had a brown glove. Here. We're gonna try your glove on first. Put your glove on. Hand is so little. How is this even possible? This is perfect. <laughs> this is gonna be funny today. <laughs> push, push. Okay. Whoa. The last look time? at daddy. Look, look, look. Can you squeeze like that? What's the? Squeeze like that. I can't. Oh. <laughs> it's, too, it's too big? Yeah. Look at, look at daddy. See? Look at daddy's fingers. Let me see. That is kind of big. You think so? Yeah. <laughs> Let me see how cute you look. Oh my goodness. That's okay. See, see how much space he's got right there? Yeah, like, we'll just fold him and he'll be good. All right. Say hi, bud. All right. Okay. Looks like we'll get those. All right, Fan Bam. So we didn't plan this. We didn't plan this. <laughs> just throwing that out there. We just got back from Elijah's uh, practice right away. He just got the hang of it. And it helps like when he yeah. was uh, about a year and a half ago when we put him in um, little t-balls, like like really, really pretty t-ball. He's grown a lot even since then, even though he hasn't played much, but just and we've him. Had, we've had a t-ball here. Like I bought him like a tea set, like a long, like when he was two years old with a ball and a bat. So he kind of knows what to do, you know? And it's just getting the basics down. I think I was telling Vanessa, like this is like the important times where he starts really absorbing, you know, the fundamentals yeah. And the basics of running the bases. Well, you guys know, in yeah. case some of you don't know, I mean, this is where it's at. This is where he's going to observe how to run those bases, hit the ball, and learn how to catch. Huh, Papa? With that being said, you guys, take a look at how good he did. One, two, three. Oh, boy. One more. One more. Good job. <laughs> part of the season and you know spending spending some time out there on the field hopefully it gets a little warmer you know he had so much fun him and his friends he's like mom i was like go dodgers yeah the dodgers it was so cute i'm so glad that he's like a people social yes. person you know he's not shy and i think all of the boys on the team are pretty outgoing yeah like, i don't think there's any i think boys are already outgoing but i mean it's just so different from layla because layla is completely the opposite from elijah <laughs> So it's just cute to see him interact with other little kids. But anyway, I want to give our post the case shout out, and that goes out to Emily M. Hey, shout out to you, girl. Thank you so much for watching our channel. We love you for that. If you guys would like a post of the case shout out, all you guys got to do is one, subscribe to our YouTube channel, two, hit the little bell button so that every time we post, you guys will get notified. And when you're done, just comment down below. Hashtag done. Till the next time, fam fam, we love you guys. Hey, by the way, join our newsletter, our email list. So you get updated every single week what we got going on in case you miss some, all right? Yes, yes, yes.